Hi, Wookie scientists. We're going to try an experiment at home today. We're going to try some ice fishing. You're going to need the following. You need some water. Pop that into your glass. In it goes. Obviously, you're going to need the main component. You're going to need some ice. That goes in. Four or five cubes is enough. Pop those in. I'll tell you what, I'll do a sick one just for luck. In they go. And I've pre-prepared this. You need some string. Now, I've got just ordinary twine. Fred will do. What I've done to help me is I've met, bent a paper clip into a hook shape. So hopefully that will help me fish out some ice. So let's give that a go. I'm gonna pop this in, drape the string in, give me the best possible chance of fishing out that ice. And on three, I'm gonna try and hook it. One, two, three. Nah, ah, not even close. So, that obviously didn't work. Luckily, science has my back on this one, and we're gonna find a way to make this. Now we're gonna do this using science. I've got that same bit of string, I've taken off the ridiculous hook off the end. I realized that wasn't helping me. What I've got instead, I've got my best friend, salt. Now, what I'm going to do, you're going to lay the same bit of string over the ice, just like before, drape it over as best you can, like so, and then you're going to add salt over the top of the string on top of the ice as well. Now, bigger the better, I've got cool salt, that'll do, but normal table salt will do the trick. You're going to spring that over. Now, you need to wait for a minute because the science is going to happen in that time. Whilst you're waiting, you can look underneath the ice. You can see some really cool wavy patterns that I'll explain in my explanation video afterwards. I'll see you in a minute. A few moments later. Uh, welcome back, folks. Um, that was a quick minute, wasn't it? Uh, you should find out, now you've added your salt, you've waited for a minute, that you pull your string out, this should happen. You should find that your ice has frozen to your string, just like this. Absolutely amazing. That's all because of our good buddy Salt. Thank you, Salt. Here's what we do now. I want you to write me in the comment box how do you think this experiment works. I'm going to do a separate video to explain it and the crazy swirly patterns that you saw under the ice as well in my next video. Until then, may the science be with you. Always. <laughs>